Hello everyone, welcome to FPGA programming tutorial. I am going to design demultiplexer 1 to 4 in which there is 2 bit selection line, 1 bit input and 4 bit output. To read 4 bit output, the data is stored to register and uh, here the always statement whenever select or demultiplexer uh, event occurs at that time this uh, statement will be executed and in uh, this is having uh, this is using case statement when it is dependent on the selection input when the selection is 0 0 the output output 0 when the input when the selection is 0 0 at that time input is going to output 0 3 when it is 1 1 the input is goes to output msv bit so this is the programming now i am going to check it i am going to synthesize this Okay, so synthesization is successful. Now I'm going to check this program using test bench. So for that, select simulation, then D multiplexer, and then select simulate behavioral model. Now in this. If the selection line is one one and input is one at that time, at that time, this input is goes to most significant bit of output now when <coughs> when this is zero zero at that time this one is it will goes to this first position and when it is zero one at that time this one and when it is One zero one 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 is here, and when if the input is zero and one zero is selected at that time, zero will come here, and when this is one one at that time zero will come here right so this is the test bench for the multiplexer 4 to 1 now i am going to implement this program on fpga so for that i have to generate i have to create constraint ucf file ucf constraint file so this is user constraint file in which selection is mapped to selection switch is mapped to port 76 pin number 76 and selection 0 is mapped to port pin 77 then input is this demultiplexer input is mapped to 78 output mapped to 16 then output first second bit mapped to 18 then output third bit is mapped to 19 and output fourth bit is mapped to 14 uh, sorry 20 so now let's implement design
okay place and route is done so we can check at the pin in out report that pin number 16 is output 0 bit and pin number 20 is output 3rd bit and 76 is selection 1 77 is selection 0 and 78 is input bit so now generate programming file So process generate programming file completed successfully. So next go to this I impact software. Then automatic project file load. Yes. Okay. If it is not there, then you just go to click on this and assign new configuration file then demultiplex so now click on here and then program it ok apply ok so program is successful now we will check uh, this demultiplexer on hardware FPGA hardware fine so in this board this this 1 and 2 are selection pin 3 is input pin and D1 D2 D3 and D4 LED will represents output this is 0th bit 1 2 and 3 bit so when if the input is 1 at that time when the selection is 0 0 so d0 d1 bit uh, will blink and when this this is 0 1 at that time d2 will on and when it is 1 1 at that time d4 is on when it is 1 0 at that time d3 is on now when this input is 0 at that time it is 1 0 so d3 is on off and when it is 1 1 when it is 0 0 at that time d1 is off and when it is 1 0 1 at that time d2 is off and when it is 1 1 at that time d4 is off so this is the uh, execution of demultiplexer 4 to 1